Hello Humana Military Friends, welcome back to our channel, please press the subscribe button so you don't miss the next updated news, thank you. The Armenian government has frequently made accusations against Turkey, which stands behind Azerbaijan. Turkey is thought to have mobilized mercenaries from Syria and Libya, to help Azerbaijan. In fact, it was Armenia who had actually sent mercenaries who had become Turkey's main enemy. In the Viva Military News, Tuesday, September 29, 2020, it was stated that Turkey had sent a number of mercenaries to Azerbaijan. These mercenaries are said to be hired by Turkey from a private security company, Sadat International Defense Consultancy Incorporated, under the command of General Adnan Tanriverdi. Then in another report cited by Viva Military of News, and, Armenia relinked Turkey with its mercenaries. The destruction of two Sukhoi Su-25 fighter jets from the Armenian military is a result of the Turkish Air Forces, TH Quay, F-16 fighting Falcon attack was used as evidence by Armenia. In a statement, the Armenian Defense Ministry confirmed that the F-16 jet was not piloted by organic Turkish soldiers. Instead, mercenaries hired from a company made by Tanriverdi. Most recently, Viva Military quoted a Middle East Monitor report. In the report, Armenia is alleged to have hired hundreds of mercenaries from the Kurdish terrorist group, the Kurdistan Workers' Party PKK. Armenia uses militias from the People's Protection Units YBG, which is one of the organizations that is Turkey's main enemy. About 300 Kurdish YPG militias are said to have entered Azerbaijan and were immediately assigned to Nagorno-Karabakh, the scene of the conflict. In that area, YPG members were also brought in to train the militia forces of the Artsakh Armed Forces, which are affiliated with the Armenian Armed Forces. We call on these countries to stay away from such provocations against Azerbaijan, and to take action. These citizens will be targeted if they participate in Armenian military operations, said assistant to the president and head of foreign policy of Azerbaijan, Hikmet Hejiniev. Meanwhile, Viva military also obtained other data from the Daily Saba. In the report, the deployment of Kurdish YPG troops to Azerbaijan was the result of a secret agreement between Armenia and the PKK, which is the parent of the militia group. The arrival of the YPG militia group is very dangerous for civilians. Because at the end of July 2020, YPG militia members were said to have carried out attacks on civilian settlements in Azerbaijan. Meanwhile, Viva military also obtained other data from the Daily Saba. In the report, the deployment of Kurdish YPG troops to Azerbaijan was the result of a secret agreement between Armenia and the PKK, which is the parent of the militia group. The arrival of the YPG militia group is very dangerous for civilians. Because at the end of July 2020, YPG militia members were said to have carried out attacks on civilian settlements in Azerbaijan.